you, you do a lot of lease purchasing and, and you consult with people, right? On occasion. You don't want to consult with me today, though, though, do you? I don't, well, I don't, I don't know if I need, a, I just need, I just I don't think so either. You sound like a well-rounded, experienced businessman. You said you did a lot of uh, different kinds of deals and everything. Why are we really talking today? I don't understand. I just need, I don't know if I need like a full, you know, consulting package. I just, just well, need probably, a contract. And, probably not. So what's the point today? Can I, do, could, do you have contracts? Could you send me some contracts? For at least purchasing I could use? I have a, I have a, I have a lot of contracts. Uh, could, you, could you send some to me? I mean, what else do you want me to send you? A sandwich, my firstborn? I mean, I, I'm not, I'm, you gotta help me a little here. No, I just, I, I wanna do a lease option. I think, I think everything's good to go. Do, oh, so you need a lease option. Go online, I'm sure you could find one somewhere or call your attorney. A couple thousand bucks, I'm sure they'll draft one for you. Oh, there, hmm. Yeah, I don't know how someone would push past that. You see, what am I doing? You're, you're telling me to go figure something else out. Do I, sound like, do I sound like a desperate, hard up, um, as hard up salesman? A desperate salesman? No. What? Give me somebody else. I want to volunteer. What would the amateur sales guy sound like if you got a phone call like that? Sure. Let me get it out to you right away. Bill Pinnell, go ahead. <laughs> Got to unmute yourself, Bill. Yeah. Um, Go ahead, Tim. You and Bill. He's the amateur sales guy. You're the you're the uh, prospect, uh, and you want something for nothing because you're so used to getting free information. Hey, hey yeah. Can I just, Bill? Thanks for taking the call. Can I just um just get some of the lease option contracts? I probably saw some online. I just want to make sure I've got really good ones, and I heard you're really good at this. Well, yeah, I I am I am good at it, and. Uh, I, I can give you the, what kind of, con you want a lease purchase contract? Just a straight up lease option? Yeah, just the, the lease yeah. option, yeah. Hey, why don't you give me your uh, email and I'll send it right off to you. And is oh. there anything else I can get for you? No, I th that's, <laughs> that's all I need, thanks. Are you sure? You yeah, do you want me it. to run it over right now? Because yeah. you're not that far away from me. No, that'll be great. Okay. And if you could just pick up a coffee on your way, thanks. Bill, no Bill, problem. Bill, you're, t you're almost too good at being the amateur <laughs> sales guy, Bill. <laughs> <laughs> because I am. <laughs> <laughs> How much money did Bill make in being that nice guy who's so, um, you're so enamored by the, the warm prospect calling you. You're bending over backwards to give him everything he wants. But why are we in business, Mr. Pinnell? To make money today. Amen, brother. To make money today. And what, what would the amateur do after he gave him the contract? Oh, I'll get it to you, whatever you want, sir. Then he'd go into the intellectual presentation probably, right? Right. And Tim yeah. would ask you questions for 35, 45 minutes, right? Yep. Okay. And I'd be giving it all to him. And then you'd ask for the order. Let's go to the <laughs> end now. Yeah, amateur sales guy. Now you're, you've given him all this free information about option money, about setting up the contract, the length of the term, uh, uh, marketing, everything. And now you're at, now you want to close him and, and watch what Tim does. Typical prospect. Okay. Go ahead. Hey, hey Tim, I can, I can hook you up with all this. I gave you a lot of info. Do you want to sign up for my consulting program? Uh, mm -hmm. Thanks, Bill. I think, you, no, you answered all my questions. I think I'm good to go now. Thanks. Are, are, are you sure? I mean, yeah. I'll, I'll be glad. You sure you don't want to sign up for the consultation program? Because I can no. help you out the rest of the way. You are super helpful already. I don't know how you do this. This is great. Thank you. Super hey. helpful already. Thank you. <laughs> Is that what, now come on, you're all on sodium pentothal and uh, a little uh, gray goose this morning, okay? Um, have we all, are we all guilty of this besides me? Yeah. How many yeah. of us are guilty of bending over backwards, free information, then asking for the order? Say, hey, I'm in a sales contest and my wife's never seen Tijuana. She never wants to either. Uh, but <laughs> And then, and then he dismisses you like Tim did. Thank you, God bless you, send me the contract. I'll call you in the near distant future, right? And, and we do this premature. so often. And, and, we, and we gave away the one thing of value that we have. What is it? 
Your Tracy knowledge. Phillips, knowledge. let me let you jump in here. Knowledge. Uh, you gave away what they wanted, their, what they were interested in the contracts, because he was uh, probably willing to give something up to get it if he felt like he needed it enough. What, what happens when we get, what's the one thing of value that we have? Our knowledge, our information, our experience, our, our ability to research or use our team or something like that. What happens when we give that all away for free because we're, oh my God, I got a real live one here. What, 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 happen, what, what happens to our value if we just give it all away for free? It plummets, it goes down, they're like, thanks, appreciate that, on to the next. Yeah, on to the next guy, right? So why do we, when we talk to people, you saw what I did earlier, I kept doing a lot of reverse mm -hmm. psychology with Tim. I was, I was going, well, just do it yourself or go to your attorney. Why was I pushing him away? What was the psychology of all that? Because anything that, anytime you're pushed away, it makes you want it more. Um, and it's that momentum. And then you, make, you also make the prospect close himself. Do we make them want, see the value in what we have? Do, they, do we make them respect us because we, we respect ourselves? Do we show the, we don't just give it away. I mean, I'm, you can give away some information, like one potato chip. But if you just give it all away, <laughs> rather in asking questions and try to create that, that urgency, that pain in the beginning, well, gee, well, you know, go to your attorney. Why do this, do that? Or why do you want to do that? What's the benefit? What, what's the agony or ecstasy to them? Creating all that emotion up front rather than do that freaking. Do you see how you stay in control so 